Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to stabilize a shot that maybe you took on a tripod and it wobbled a little bit or you didn't take on a tripod and it's super wobbly. Um, can I just say my first recommendation is to always use a tripod, but if you needed to cover something breaking or it was really quick and you didn't grab it, there is a way in Final Cut that you can stabilize the shot. So let's look at the shot in question. Uh, let me bring the sound down so that doesn't play into anything. You can see how it's a little bit wobbly, it's a little bit wobbly, um, but it's not too bad, right? So the first thing that I'm going to do is select a clip, come over to the inspector and make sure that I am in the video section. Look at this one that looks like a little film strip. As soon as I click that, it opens up a whole new like area of the things that I can do. And then all I'm going to do is turn on the stabilization effect. So as soon as I turn it on, can you see that there's these little dots on top of the clip? These are showing me that this is what the computer still has left to process, left to render. And I need to wait for all of those to be gone, which means that the computer has already gone through all of that, thought about how to apply that effect that I'm asking it to. And you can also see here in the main viewer, it's telling me analyzing for dominant motion. So it's thinking about it really hard, thinking about what it is that I'm trying to stabilize. And for the most part, Final Cut does a really good job of stabilizing shots. Let's see if we can try and play it a little bit. I know it's not done yet, but just to see the effect. Can you see how different that is from the original one? So let me put the original one down here without any effects for comparison. So that's the original. Look at how it's jumping up and down versus that, which is a lot smoother.